Hello everybody, my name is Josh Nader and today I'm going to be showing you guys um, a, a tutorial for Unity and this tutorial is basically going to be um, how to move your character in 3D up, down, left and right and this is going to be very quick, super easy um, I, I, I made this video because I, I had a very hard time figuring it out and I wanted to share with you guys so I did it over here, if we click play, we're gonna go to our game and as you can see, we can move around wherever we want and it works. And it also works with the arrow key, so it works with WASD and arrow key, whichever, it, it works with both. Oh, by the way, um, if you're wondering how to make them red, all you have to do is go in project, uh, right click, go in create, then select material, and then, um, once you have your material, you can go over here, select the color, then all you have to do is drag the material uh, and scene view to whatever you want to turn that color. All you're going to want to do is build a, a, plat um, a platform, just like that, for your thing. Then you're going to make your player, so so far we don't have uh, anything on the player, normal. No, we don't even have, we, we don't have a um, uh, widget body or anything. And um, for your, um, what I'm doing is I'm going for like a 2D camera view. It doesn't have to be. I mean, you can make your camera view, uh, your camera view, whatever. I just like moved it on top and uh, rotated it down. And uh, to rotate it downwards, just go rotation on the first one X and type in 90. And um, yeah. So uh, I'm gonna show you the code for this, but um, this is gonna be different because I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna sit there and just type out the code. I'm just gonna give it to you straight up. So, first thing you wanna do is you're gonna wanna add rigid body on that. Then you wanna go and add a new script. Just name that player movement. Create an add. Right, let's open that in mode of And see, this is so hot to me. I just wanna delete everything. And now, uh, right now, I just wanna go in the description of this video. And and uh, you're going you're going to want to go in the description, and in the description it's going to have all the code. So all you want to do is copy and paste the code in the description. Make sure you copy you paste it right down there. Paste here, and this is what the code should look like. All right, save that. Go into the Unity, and now if you go in game to play, you should see it that yes we have it so um uh, i was recording earlier and i made the biggest mistake i forgot to add rigid body so do not forget to add rigid body and as you can see it moves flawlessly perfectly and um if you stop this as you uh, if you go on your player and if you go on the player the script you can see we have speed so you can change this speed right now it's at 18 you can change it to one which is extremely slow um anyways if you look down here you see we have this um speed thing i was recording when i walked in um so we have the speed thing and uh when you put the code in it should be at 18 but you can edit it to however you want to like change it to thousand for the rolls and like <laughs> look how fast that is um i'll move it back to 20 maybe and uh, should be a little bit faster than 18. Yep, oh, just got some lag. Uh, what? Oh, wait, what? It's still the thousands. Alright. So we got to 20. Yeah, the, the part of the number it might be, uh, be a little bit slower to run. So we have a little loading time. But this is at speed 20. This is, this is about right. Uh, one more thing. Uh, what's cool about this is um, it works for WASD and arrow keys. So, yeah, so in case you want arrow keys WASD, it works for both of them. I'm just going to go over real quick. Okay, so all you have to do is add a rigid body to your player, uh, make a new script, open it in uh, Mono Develop or whatever you use. Go in the description, copy and paste the code that's in the description, and just paste it in the model to develop and just save. Go back to the movie, adjust your speed, and that's all. It takes five minutes, probably best.
So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, uh, if you want to see more tutorials, basically, or like maybe how to do some TV mode or other things, uh, leave a like and uh, and comment down below on what you want me to do. If this was helpful, uh, I'm gonna be uploading more of these videos, so turn notifications on and subscribe. Um, thank you guys for watching. This has been Josh Nader, and bye.